Tuesday the 20th of October, nice weather for October, and we're standing on a footbridge about, what, half a mile roughly north of Batley, and its days are numbered, we think, because when you electrify this line, whenever that may be, a few years ago I was expecting it to be done before I was 50, well that's very unlikely considering that my 50th birthday is February next year. Anyway, switching cameras. And this is looking towards Batley. You can see Lady Anne crossing down there. Just uh, if I come a bit further down this end, you will. Oh, maybe not. But it's through the trees down there where the flyover was. This is looking towards Leeds in the down direction. Okay. And uh, there's a mobile phone mast there, and that's what it'll be. So, yeah. Not sure how long this footbridge has uh, got left, but uh, you see this end of the footbridge was demolished. Uh, it fell down so, over 20 years ago, I think, probably near 30 actually. It's been like this with just this um, metal fence around it. There is, that's my shopping down there in case you're wondering. So yeah, it uh, dates from the earliest days of steam does this bridge and I think it provided access to a shoddy works somewhere over there near where Hale Sedell is and whatever but yeah I thought you'd like to see it anyway if I just go back down this side shortly you can see it's definitely like an old steam type footbridge from a steam railway you ought to take it to Pilning didn't they rebuild it there but say so, yes it's been here since since the earliest days of the railway as far as I'm aware and, and all that. So anyway, we're going to go up that way now and head on. Oh dear. Let's grab my shopping. It did have the boards, the, these boards stolen some years ago. It did. If there's a train coming, I'll film a train here. Right, from here you can just about see Lady Anne crossing and the signal box and whatever. You see the walls where the Great Northern Railway went over the top just there. Up until 1964, 65, something like that. The bridge was taken out, I think, the early 70s. Now, going back pre about, what, about 1989, 1990, there used to be a signal just, just there. You can just see the base of it covered in some lighter some sort of like bluer stone but uh, so it was moved not sure when but I think it was about the late 80s early 90s and it's now there but it's back to us because where Howley Crossing used to be where the crossing house is just there that um, was our you know earliest experience of trains as, as kids me and my brother and family sort of thing in the 70s and early 80s so there should be a train setting off from Batley, literally now as we speak. A Wigan Leeds service. Yeah, I can hear it. You can hear it, can't see it yet, but we're near it. I thought we'd uh, get a shot here. Right, there's nothing else due for a while now, so uh, we'll just better head on and uh, so enjoy this video. Don't know how long this footbridge has got left, but uh, who knows, it might uh, be raised for overhead wires at some point, it might just be got rid of. There is a plan to take a path 
down here. I'll switch cameras again. What we've got here now is plans to divert it down there and maybe chop some of them trees down, put a bit of a, like a bridge over the stream and then take it underneath. It's a possibility. Anyway, let's get going. 